Welcome back guys, today we've got another great video on XRP, so in this video guys I'll, I'll talk about technical analysis and do a bit of a price prediction and also cover some of the latest news um, about XRP that's been going around and, and also I mean I talk about Ripple and XRP interchangeably but it's the XRP coin that I'll be talking about mainly and I'll give you some updates on Ripple as well guys. So guys there was a question about my price prediction and, and there was some questions about whether I day trade or hold and why I'm, I'm buying at a higher price of 35 cents rather than buying it lower so I'm going to try to explain that as well at the end of this video so let's cover one of the key news that's come out for XRP and it is XRP fiat pairs coming to Bittrex so Bittrex used to be the biggest probably one of the biggest ones I used to use myself now I've moved more to Binance and Binance is probably the most popular altcoin exchange now but Bittrex is still massive and fiat pairs with Bittrex and XRP is only positive for XRP there's going to be more volumes more people are going to buy XRP so there might be a short term boost of the price of XRP but it's nothing long term or sustainable we need more like adoption or partnerships that will help XRP but nonetheless nevertheless this is a positive news for XRP and um, another news that's been going around for a while really Ripple Ripple trying to get into China and kind of get adoption for XRP it's difficult to talk about Ripple and XRP guys I've talked about the differences they're not the same thing I might use it interchangeably and apologies if I do but if I just title my videos XRP technical analysis XRP news people don't really understand it that's why I have to say Ripple and talk about Ripple it's a lot easier to say but XRP and Ripple are different so Ripple is one of the like I've said one of the most controversial cryptocurrencies and it is because you know Ripple is quite centralized although XRP XRP is not as centralized and they're trying to decentralize XRP as much as they can and um, if you're a believer of Ripple or XRP you know you 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 feel very passionately that XRP will become more decentralized and they've got so much adoption adoption and with X Rapids they will succeed so this company um, is trying to get into China we've heard loads of news about it and he's talked about himself you know China uh, is definitely of interest it's definitely a target the vice president of uh, European strategic accounts at Ripple told CNBC in a phone interview China is definitely a country and region of interest and they are you know they've got some presence in 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 the Asian market Hong Kong based financial firm from Lian Lian International to use this platform to process cross-border China but how can they break into mainland China breaking into mainland China not just for cryptocurrencies but any uh, foreign companies is like the holy grail is so difficult but there's so much money but it's very difficult to break into China you have to make partnership or, or what is it like you have to make it in China to sell it in China or there's a law so it's very difficult for Ripple or XRP to get into China and, and also you know China's stance on banning ICOs and cryptocurrencies so China it, is kind of against cryptocurrency currently they're trying to develop their own blockchain and all they're trying to do all their own stuff so it's very difficult so i don't know how much of this is true but the things that it's negative about ripple being you know bank friendly or not really decentralized as much those can help ripple break into china because china doesn't want to do with cryptocurrencies and altcoins and Ripple is slightly different to most of the other cryptocurrencies so that could help Ripple and XRP to get into China so China is a leading process uh, pl payment processing platforms playing it in XRP could play a role in the Chinese financial market which would allow increase of capital capitalization of XRP Ripple has not yet revealed its effort to penetrate the market but these are all potential this is something that could help massively if Ripple can succeed Um, I was talking um, so I, I gave you two positive news but I've got to share this as well this is slightly older news is 23rd of July but it was shared on Facebook and I wanted to share it so I've talked about some of the positives of Ripple and how Ripple can get big but on this channel guys I like to talk about positives and negatives so Crypto Rocco if you haven't subscribed guys please scroll down and subscribe I'd like to share with you both positives and negatives and I, I'm happy to have a discussion with you in this in the in the bottom so if you want if you have any questions or you don't agree with something leave your comments below and we can have a logical discussion not just it's a scam I hate you it's going to the moon let's have logical discussion so one thing that can't be de denied is XRP has got a lot of lawsuits and and there, there's potential ruling that it could be ruled as um 
as a security you know bitcoin and ethereum came out that they're not security the sec have confirmed but if you if, if ripple comes out to be a, a security this is going to be massively wrong for ripple i think ripple's price would could go to even less than 10 cents guys if it comes out as security this will be a massive blow not just for ripple but the whole cryptocurrency um so this is massive news but do i think it's a security i actually think it's not guys reading about the howie law i think it is i've read that and i actually i said bitcoin ethereum never no way their security i've said that in my previous video but i'd say ripple is not as well so their ripple strategic chief marketing strategist said we absolutely are not a security we don't meet the standards Um brad garlinghouse said i think it's clear really clear xrp is not a security so they're saying it's not and i tend to believe it's not but again we'll have to see how it plays out guys we'll have to wait for the sec announcement but we just have to keep that in mind if it comes out as a security the it, the prices of ripple will go down but if you believe in ripple in the long term it will go up if you believe in even if it's a security it will take a hit in the short term but long term guys if you believe in the adoption and the vision of ripple it will still be great for ripple if you believe in it this is not financial advice i want you to do your own research i'm just sharing you the positives and the negatives of ripple and hope you guys understand it so this is kind of a very speculative news can the partnership of ripple and jp morgan push xrp to five dollars again this is crazy i don't know why they've come out with it i, I and this is just i need to learn their advertising and marketing technique because people are clicking on it and the article doesn't really talk about it and at the end it talks about that the ba bank has its own blockchain and unlikely to partner with ripple so this is a very speculative article but you know but nevertheless a partnership with jp morgan will be brilliant for ripple and um, my next video guys i'll talk about the convergence that's coming out i'll talk about it in detail what it means for x rapids and xrp so this is quite big i'll cover it in my next video so, so if you haven't subscribed to my channel stay tuned guys i'll make a detailed video and explain to you everything that you need to know about the convergence so before finishing this video let's do a quick price analysis in my previous video guys i've talked about um I think my last video one was uh, I think the 18th I released my last video three days ago I talked about not 0.35 cents being a massive resistance and he actually played out guys ripple broke that not 0.35 um the resistance but it couldn't hold on to if it held on to it, I would have got into ripple and it's kind of going down now and it's looking quite bearish guys if you look at the chart it's not looking brilliant for ripple it, it, it touched it went through not 0.35 but it couldn't sustain it guys the double top or triple top and it went down and currently it's broken another resistance level as well so they were talking about this resistance like but currently guys ripple is below that ripple is at 33 cents so it's, it's, it's broken that trend line and if it doesn't recover the hundred the 100 uh, moving average would probably be strong but i mean if it stays below it guys and if bitcoin doesn't stay strong i could see it going below to you know 30 cents before we can see an uptrend so it's not looking great for ripple this is one of the later uh, uh, analysis that's come out and uh, the pri ripple price started downward moving from the 33 35 cent swing high against the us dollars there was a break below crucial bullish trend line with the support so this is the bullish trend line we were talking about and it's broken below that as well so it's not looking great and the pair tested not 35 uh, 31 cents support and is currently at a risk for more losses below that so it's not looking great for ripple and the rsi is not looking great it's broken through that resistance level that i've talked about and the 100 moving average as well so it's not all good signs for ripple but we'll have to see how it plays out uh, currently guys i'll say i'm not I'm, I'm i'm staying out of the market the rsi macd not looking great either so the one thing i'd like to explain to you so you guys were saying why am i bullish for ripple if it goes above 35 cents because it, it's going on an upward trend and if it breaks the resistance there's more bias coming in so if you're a day trader you could i could talk about it i'll probably talk about my technical analysis in another video if you're a day trader you could scalp and make the money so that's everything all the thing i said but if you're a 
um, hodler or long-term investor, you believe in Ripple, just dollar cost average and buy it. So buy it now, buy it low, buy it low. But if you believe it will grow below it and I could trade and buy more, I'll trade and make more money. But if you believe in Ripple and cryptocurrency, just dollar cost average and it should be good. So thank you very much for watching this video, guys. If you have enjoyed it, smash that like button, subscribe to my channel. I also do Litecoin giveaways. So if you want to win half a Litecoin, leave your Litecoin addresses below and turn on the notification button so thank you very much guys smash that like button subscribe to my channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much